Hi, this is Scott of Scott's Computer Repair. I'm here to show you how to do a factory reset a Lenovo I <coughs> excuse me, a Lenovo ID Idea Pad S400 Touch. Basically, it makes your lab, you might before we do perform this method, you want to make sure all your pictures, your documents, if it is important to you or pertinent to you, uh, onto a drive, flash drive, or anything, if you can, before you do this. Uh, this will mind you. This will wipe uh, wipe the um, any if you have any viruses on it, it will wipe it. If you have performance issues, it should take care of those performance issues and everything else. So basically, it is make sure your laptop is completely powered down, power cord plugged in. On to the left side of this laptop, there should be a button. I'll just play it on the screen here. On the left side up here, by the side of the power button. Okay, right here. Okay. Basically, just push it. This screen right here should come right up. Okay, you want to go down to System Recovery. And enter. Full screen to boot up for the factory restore. Okay. Okay. All right. Go ahead and keep it on the first option. Basically, right here, restore from initial backup system partition. Be restored in initial status. And click next. Alright, this basically tells you what's going to happen here. Basically, just go ahead and click Start. This will tell you to restore to the system partition initial state now. This said you bound to back up your pictures or documents that are important to you. Click Yes. Same thing, just click Yes again. And it's Start. Okay, after that's done, go to and just click OK. And after that, just click done. Go ahead and click reboot. Right. 
Okay, make sure all your information is correct, like your country, region, language, and your keyboard layout. If everything looks correct, you just click next. Make sure you check the accept the uh, license agreement terms. Click that and click accept. This is where you can choose your sh uh, color scheme, like your background and stuff. You want, you know. And after you choose whatever, leave this way that is, unless you want to change your PC name. Click next. If you have a Wi-Fi in your house or thing, you want to click to make sure you select your Wi-Fi connection and click connect. Enter your password or pass key. Usually it's okay down the modem or router or whatever you're using. Make sure you enter it correctly. And after that, just click connect. Use Express Settings, click Use Express Settings. Um, if you'd like to create a Microsoft account account or if you have one, go ahead and sign in right now at this moment and all your information. This is for our customer laptop because I don't have all our information. I'm gonna go ahead and click Sign In Without Microsoft Account. And after that, then, uh, then click Local Account. If you want, type in the per like Owner or whatever your name is you want to put in here. And after that, just click finish after you type the name. Okay, that's how you do a factory reset on Lenovo Idea Pad S400 Touch. Basically, it. If this video was helpful and if it worked out for good, please like and subscribe or leave a comment below for any questions. I appreciate you watching my video and you have a good day. Thank you.